Well good afternoon folks, um, welcome to another video. Hope you enjoyed that virtual tour of the new LTFM Istanbul New Airport Scenery by Scenery TR. It's a gentleman by the name of Sunay Kilic and uh, has a website www.scenerytr.com He's a one-man band, basically a single senior creator. He's been doing scenery since 2009. There's a number of good freeware sceneries for you to check out if you want to go to that site. And he also has three really good payware sceneries now, all of which I got. Um, Ankara Esenboja, um, Istanbul, the other airport, Sabihar Gotchen, I probably didn't say that correctly, but there we go. And that's LTFJ. And of course, this new scenery now just come out for P3D LTFM, the new Istanbul airport. What you saw a moment ago, I hope you enjoyed it, was just an interesting virtual tour so you can see some of the detail. We're going to take a quick hop to the coast because he's added some bits and pieces there. Um, and um, yeah, okay, I've got Orbix Global and bits and pieces and Vector installed. But um, the whole place looks wonderful. The, sc the scenery itself is, um, is stunning. Very, very well done texturing um, inside, as you can see by the previous bit of video. Anyway, let's stop talking, let's get in here and um, go and have a look around. I really like the scenery. I fly in Turkey quite a bit because I fly for Pegasus Airlines. But this is the first time I've actually flown into this airport. And I just think it's excellent, very well done. So let's buzz the control uh, first. A little bit of speed and transitional lift going here. The gates are all sewed by the way, they all work. Um, I flew into uh, here the other night and um, <coughs> I actually flew into the A321 and uh, it works beautifully. The gates work lovely, the um, evening lighting is good. Get some altitude here. As you can see there are two towers depending on um, what part of the airport you're in. Ground texture is nice. Okay, so a lot of it is low resolution. It's extremely expensive to get high resolution ground textures. But it still looks nice. I don't plan to take too long, but I thought we would just have a look at what's around the coastline here. It's late afternoon, so the sun is dipping. I've set it for summertime. Um, I haven't shown anything for the night time, but you can take it from me that the night time uh, visuals, textures, lighting is just as good as dusk. It's beautiful, it's really really nice. So we have very very slight pauses here but um, really nothing I would consider that serious. It's a big download, it's a big scenery, 1.2 gig um, on a par with um, the sort of size that Airsoft would do if they were doing this kind of product but um, it, it's lovely, I really like it
as you can see there's quite a bit of work gone in here um, and this isn't even near the airport looks really good done a lovely job I think and I like the coastline too the touches the ground terrain looks really nice we're not that high but it's good enough to be passable it's excellent so let's turn into the airport and um, go make a landing somewhere I actually never realised how big this airport is it's huge but uh, the ILS's work, these eyes are accurate um, they've done, this guy's done an excellent job I keep talking about they um, as a company which I guess he is but when you consider this is a piece of work done by one guy it's phenomenal, he's done an incredible job he's modelled everything it's really impressive now I've recently bought the FS Labs A321 having got and enjoyed the uh, 320 and um, yeah, can't wait to bring one out here from the UK and fly into this place, especially in the summer and look how beautiful it is So we've got moving vehicles as well, you can see just down to the left there there's a bus. Frame rates are good, ok I've got an i9 processor, 32 gigs of RAM, running off an SSD, and it's P3D version 4.5, not the latest, um, and it runs fine, absolutely fine on my rig. sure if you can see the cars on the road on the motorway ahead it's an excellent job um, I think people have been waiting for this airport to come along for some time and finally somebody's done a marvellous job on it and uh, hats off to this guy worth every penny See if I can make a half decent landing here. Yeah, not too bad at all. Well, thank you for joining me. Um, <coughs> short video, but hopefully enough for you to have a good look at this and judge just how good it is. I really like it. Happy to support the efforts of um, single developers, especially when they produce work this good. Um, 
excellent as I said it's um, available now from Sim Market it's had lots of good reviews at the moment um, I hope you like this virtual tour and it gives you an idea what you're seeing before you buy it um, but it's excellent details really good it's as good as anything from fly tamper or anything like that uh, and it's a massive airport so get your charts out but uh, yeah wonderful piece of work 25 euros from sim market at the moment from single developer scenery tr visit his website and um give him a couple of likes if you will so uh, yeah thank you very much um if you like this kind of thing please like and subscribe I uh, put a video up at least once a week, usually on a Sunday. Sometimes I get to do a few more. Um, so I'll keep producing if um, it's the sort of thing you're interested in. Anything you want me to do, let me know in the comments below. I also have a website, virtualairlinepilot.org. Um, I've got new plans for it this year, new year now. Um, going to improve the blog and um, just basically tidy up the site and make it a little bit more accessible. Um, in due course we will have a Facebook group coming and um, an Instagram for Virtual Airline Pilot I need to get some help with that to make sure I can get it done properly I tried it before it didn't work out too well so uh, that will come along so look out for that so what remains for me is to, is to say um, Happy New Year to you thank you to those squash subscribers I have so far who've um, supported me over the last four or five months I've been doing this and uh, thank you very much I reach out to you all you're very important to me and um, I look forward to seeing you in the next video so take care happy new year stay safe and we'll see you again soon this is Lee saying bye for now